In this video, you will learn how to add, edit or remove grid line from Microsoft Excel graph. The procedure is same for scatter plot, line graph or bar graph. In addition, you will also learn how to change color of these grid lines, how to adjust the width of these grid lines and how to insert vertical and horizontal measure as well as minor grid lines in Microsoft Excel graph. So let's start this video. In a separate sheet, I have already entered the data. To save time, first select this data to insert a graph. I have selected this data, go to insert option. And here you will find the option of charts. From chart, choose first one. You can select any graph type, I will choose this one. I will place it here. Now you will learn how to add edit or remove grid line. Firstly, Click on this graph. Now you can see here this graph is selected. At the corner you will find the option of plus sign which is the chart element option. Click on it. You will find different options. And here is the option of grid lines. If you check this option, grid line appeared on this graph. If I uncheck it, you can observe that grid line will be removed. Now let's explore more option. Select this one. Now you can see here, grid line appeared here. Now here is the option of arrow. Click on it and you will find more options. Now here is the option of primary, major, horizontal. Currently you can see here only major horizontal lines appeared here. If I am interested to insert major vertical lines as well, I will choose this option. Now you can see here, major vertical lines also appeared here. If I uncheck this option, then these lines will be removed. I will select this one. In addition, if you are interested to insert minor horizontal line, you can select this option. Similarly, if you are interested to insert minor vertical line, you can choose this option. If you check this option, lines appeared here. If you uncheck this, then these lines will be removed. Now here is the option of more option. You can explore more options. I will place it here. Firstly, select any lines. You have four type of line. First one is the major vertical, minor vertical, major horizontal and minor horizontal. For example, in this case, I will select major vertical line. I will click on this line and all line will be selected. Now you can see here. All major horizontal lines are selected. This is indicated by these small circles. Now I will choose solid line and I can adjust their color. For example, I will choose purple one. Now you can see here color is changed to purple. Similarly, if I choose red color, then color will be changed to red. From here you can adjust the width of these lines. For example, in this case I will change the width to 1.5 pt. I will change it 1.5 pt and you can observe that width of this line is changed now. Similarly, if I am interested to change the width of this vertical line, I will click on any line. All vertical major lines are selected. From here I can choose the color of these lines. And from here I can adjust the width of these lines. If I scroll down you will observe more option. Here is the option of compound type. You can change the compound type using these options. For example I will select double line instead of single line. Now you can see here double lines appeared here. Similarly here is the option of cap type. You can select any type option. Similarly here is the option of join type. Now here is the option of begin arrow type. Select this one and from here I will choose this one. Similarly here is the option of begin arrow size. I will select this one. And here is the option of end arrow type. I will choose this one. And end arrow size I will choose this one. If I click here now you can see here. This is the end arrow type and this is the start of arrow type. So by using these options, you can easily add, edit or remove grid line in Microsoft Excel graph. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching this video. Goodbye.